What's going on YouTube? This is Ice Cold Eskimo, as you can clearly see. I just got back from a midnight release of, oh, well, I think that's pretty obvious. And this is one of the only games I've spent so much freaking money on. $150, but I'm hyped for it. And I just got it home, and I'm going to unbox this thing and show you guys what it's all about. First off, there was a raffle at the store I went to, GameStop obviously, and I won a little post well a big poster that's kind of cool and uh i helped my friend pay for his uh collector's edition of the guide which was like 30 bucks i didn't couldn't pre-order mine in time and it came with a a calendar for i think it's like an 18 month calendar that came with it i was a little bummed i didn't get the uh the guide but he gave me the calendar for paying for it yeah that's pretty cool. And now for, of course, the game. Bam, check this out. Yeah. Comes with everything pictured there. And so, let's open this thing up. All right, let's just. Okay, I got like, are these both metal? No, alright, this is a, I think a steel case. No, this is the booklet. You get a turn towards the light. Borderlands 2, I'm guessing this is the art book. Yeah. Scooter. Catch a ride, Handsome Jack. Some concept, concept artwork. Oh man, I cannot, like, I don't even feel like doing this video right now, but, yeah, this is awesome, and I want to make a video of it. So yeah, got an art book, Borderlands 2. What's next? What is this? I think this is the cloth map you get. One sec, let me set my camera down real quick. Let's see if I can... Get this in here. Bam. It's made of, you know, cloth, not paper, which is awesome. Unlike the Skyrim one, which, like, it's kind of paper, but it's, it's like a freaking halfling of whatnot. All right, well. I don't feel like holding this so you can all get a look but we'll do it anyways we'll do it anyways the air nexus so that's what i got there oh my god i just remembered something i left my receipt in my friend's car and then it has the codes for the dlc whatever i'll call them and give it, me, give it to me over the phone certificate of authenticity does it have a number on here i am number 10744 out of 53,160. And you got little Marcus, seal of approval, 2K games and gearbox. That's freaking awesome. I got that. Just lacing this out for the final shot later. All right. Let's see what's next. Um, I got extra skins for what is it bald that's not an attractive look well yeah you get bonus well i don't want to turn it around might have yeah a code on there but you get bonus stuff like uh character customizing items to make you stand out from everyone else online you know all eight million zeros that are gonna be playing what's this all about i feel like something's about to fall out huh all right I think these are art cells or something. Caseless auto. All right. Ah, uh, these are like advertisements, like in-game ones, I guess. Opportunity rise above. Fight back. Ah, oh, there's Roland. Like him and Brick were kind of missing from uh, promotional ads, so I was actually. Professional. I was actually like wondering, like talking to people online about, I wonder what's up with them from the previous game. 
And bam. Mad Moxie. Live at the fridge. Congratulations. Oh, conflagrations, electrocutions, and mutilations. Live at the fridge. Sounds, uh, you know, attractive. Bam. So, that's pretty sick. I wish I could follow this stuff up. Like where I live right now, it doesn't really accommodate me uh, putting things up on the walls. Otherwise, this room would all just be a nerd den, but it'd be awesome. Borderlands 2, I think this is the game. I thought it would just be like a bonus metal case that comes with it, but no, you get the actual game in here. Let's see if I can open it real quick. Just ruined the resale value. Psh, but this isn't getting resold. <laughs> Not in a million years. And then even then it wouldn't get sold. Bam! The game. That's what everyone's which what I should be playing right now. My PlayStation's over there. I should just pop this mofo in and let's see the you know manual guide whatnot for all you people still need to learn how to turn your console on so boom got a little of that what's over here i have no clue what this is looks like another poster I think these are like a bunch of creatures or something. It's like one long poster. Let's see if I can get some of this in the shot. I would focus my camera, but then I'd have to drop this thing. Let's see if I can keep the light on it at least. Sorry it's dark in here, but uh, when I got home, my friend was already like KO so I told him he's gonna just gonna have to deal with the light because I had to do this video so I got one long poster thingy uh, how do you like close this properly yeah whatever I'm gonna just lay it out let's see what else is in here Bam. What are these? Stickers? Are these stickers? I think these are stickers. Why am I not playing this game right now? I went there straight after work. I got off work at like 10.15 and I just sat out there. Luckily my friends work at the game store so it wasn't all boring. Especially with the little incident with the roach. Oh yeah. One of my friends was sitting down outside and a freaking gigantic cockroach landed on his uh, shoulder. He's calling it Cockzilla, but you know, obviously that's not a smart name to give your roach. We'll give a roach, because the obvious reference. I'm pretty sure these are stickers, but bam, borderline, bar, ugh, Borderlands, minion on board. I would never put this on anything. This I would, but I mean, come on, now, just giant logos aren't really that appealing if it's not directly related to the game. What else is in here? A field journal of Hammerlock. He was uh, that black dude with the robotic leg in the promotional video. Oh wow, this is like an actual journal. Might have to give this a read soon. Not tonight, or tomorrow, because I'm going to be going to be all up in this game. Alright. Let's move some of this out of the way. Let's uh, see what's going on here. Oh, there's a box in the box. All right, let me just Ugh. Let me take this out. Is it like stuck or something? to undo this box. Where's my knife? I think the box is like glued in there or something. So I'm just gonna have to... Sorry about that, my camera ran out of memory. So yes, this is the loot chest. Once again, and uh, I was actually a little bummed. I was expecting everything to come in this, but 
you know, I'm not going to be like pissed, I still got it. Just open this thing up real quick. Take a better look at it. I'm not one of those collectors who will buy something freaking awesome and then never open it. Like, it bugs me. Like, if I get something cool, I want to, like, you know, have it. Alright. Is there, like, a lock or something? I don't want to break this thing before. Alright, there's a little button you press. Opens up. This is the lid to the Marcus bobblehead that came in one of the uh, vending machines. I actually thought this was supposed to be a bobblehead like stand too that you got, but it's just a box. Now this I might actually just leave in the box. I mean, I don't really... No, no, I'm totally gonna break this thing out later, but whatever. But, ouch. Inside there's nothing. I was expecting there to be the little shells that pop out too. I'm very optimistic. But it's kind of just like a plastic insert. I guess you could stand like a few games in here or whatever. But other than that, it's kind of just plastic, plastic uh, chest. I wonder if there's like, oh, uh, there's like a gearbox logo and whatnot. Let's see if I can focus this. 2K gearbox. Looks all beat up and dusty. <clears throat> All right, well, that is the, that is it for my little unboxing. Let me just take a step back and show you all the cool crap I got again. Well, it's all sprawled out on my bed, sorry about that, but I don't really care. Once again, art book, concept art, a bunch of stickers and, you know, all that stuff. The Hammerlock Journal, the Marcus Bobblehead, uh, this long freaking banner banner poster picture the game in a collectible steel tin with a claptrap on the back a collection of like in-game posters pretty much goes with the art for me I love art though you get the DLC for the extra skins the cloth map for the game uh, poster I won doesn't come with the collectible shenanigans a Borderlands uh, Certificate of Authenticity. I think I might just toss that in the chest actually for stuff I'm probably never going to really mess with. Shazam. And just because I helped a friend out get his collector's uh, guide, I got a poster. And there you go. This is Ice Cold Eskimo with uh, Frozen Pixel Gaming, our YouTube page. Thank you for joining me for this unboxing and enjoy this game i'll be playing on ps3 if anyone wants to play just hit me up or something my psn is ice cold eskimo so uh yeah see you in the game man later